everybody and welcome to my kitchen. This is a little bit different today because um, I'm actually not cooking anything and I can actually read your comments and respond to them, which is something I don't normally, oh, it's kind of cute hair. It's because I, oh, thank you. <laughs> um, but today, what we're gonna talk about is my favorite things and things that I am suggesting on my holiday gift guide. So for those of you who don't know me, I'm Michelle Tam of Nom Nom Paleo, and this is my older son, Big O, or Owen. And I'm gonna talk about the stuff that's on my 2015 holiday gift guide, and you can find all the details on my blog at nomnompaleo.com. And so I'm just gonna go over really quickly all the things that I really, really love. Um, and they are things that I have researched and I have bought myself, I gift other people, um, and so these are things I really love. So first of all, oh, and for those of you tuning in, we are going to do a giveaway. We're going to do two giveaways. We're going to give away a signed book. We're all going to sign it, our whole family. Um, a doll and Nom Nom Paleo socks. And I think we even have like a Nom Nom Paleo tote bag. So two people are going to win this whole Nom Nom package. Oh yeah, Vigo is getting really tall. He's going to be taller than me soon, I think. And this is Lilo for those of you who don't know. This is Ollie. And they are going to determine who wins the two contests. Can we do the thing that they get to? We will, we will. We'll, okay, we'll, we'll show them really quick. Um, oh, someone says, okay. So first I'm gonna talk about, oh, you can make sure that I go over things properly. But um, I broke down my holiday gift guide into all the things that I love. <laughs> and so I, I, I kind of, well, I love eating but I like things that will make cooking easier for me. And one of the things I always talk about is the Instant Pot. I've gone on and on and on about it. So here's my Instant Pot. I think it's fantastic. Um, I even mentioned in the blog post two cookbooks that I think are really great starter cookbooks. They aren't necessarily paleo, but they totally tell you how to use an Instant Pot. And that's Laura Pazaglia's Hip Pressure Cooking Cookbook. And America's Test Kitchen has a really great cookbook called, I think, pressure cooker perfection. And those are um, in the post. Um, I love my Breville Smart Oven. It's over there in the corner. I can't really show it, but we use it all the time. We used it today to make bacon for breakfast. I use it even more than our regular oven. Um, and I think it's worth the investment. I know it's not cheap, um, but I think it's, it's a pretty nifty thing. Oh, also, I love this. This is actually right here all the time. It's so warm. This is my Cuisinart um, uh, water kettle. I used to have another one that was cheaper, but I love this one because it has all of these really nifty um, temperatures, like right here on the handle, um, for all the different teas that you can do. Um, and it keeps it warm. So my old one, it would boil and then it would just drop temperature. Uh, and so I love that. Uh, and questions. How many quarts is that? Oh, how many quarts? This is a six quart. I have two. I have the old six in one, which, oh, people have asked me, like, what's the difference between all the Instant Pots? Which one should I get? I like the new, I think it's the Duo 60. Um, but I like the six quart seven in one. So the latest one. And people say, should I get the smart one? I have the smart one. But I don't use the Wi-Fi, so, and the one I've gifted everybody is just the 7-in-1 without the Wi-Fi smart um, features. I'm sure it's great, the smart features, but I just don't personally use it, and I think a lot of people don't use it. So I would just get the 7-in-1. I think on Amazon it's like $105. I bought mine for like $130-ish, um, which I still think is a great deal. But 105 is pretty good. And then the Black Friday deal was $78. So if you guys want to wait, I'm sure when it's Prime Day again or Black Friday, it'll come down again in price. But um, I don't. I, we do Another question. Is yeah. the giveaway open to just the U.S.? No. The giveaway, I will send it internationally. So I, and I will send this myself. It will go to the post office and I will send it myself. It may not come by Christmas, but the two winners will win fair and square if they guess the numbers that Owen and Ollie are going to put down on a piece of paper. Uh, other things that I love for cooks, I think this microplane is my favorite thing. I've gone on and on about how amazing it is. In my Vietnamese lemongrass chicken recipe, I tell you how amazing it is to mince lemongrass with this. I love it for ginger. You freeze ginger. That's where I keep all my ginger because then it doesn't get moldy in the fridge or on the counter. 
Um, and then you can make this fantastic ginger snow that just melts into all of your dishes without the um, the string. Oh, someone says they're giving my magic mushroom powder as a Christmas present. Yes, and I even have a, a, an old post from last year where you can print out labels. Um, Kyle wants to know why I'm so damn good looking. Why is Kyle? Kyle? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Kyle. Oh, if you guys don't know Kyle, he has the best blog ever. It's ourdailybrine.com. Um, and we're gonna see him in, in Portland. But if you want a really, really great website to learn about DIY stuff, um, ourdailybrine.com is the way to go. Yes, ginger snow is amazing. Um, and so, in terms of the two different microplanes, I think there's different ones that you can get um, on Amazon. I love the one with the handle. They have other ones with like fancier colors, but this black one is fine, and I think it's like $12. This is an older microplane that doesn't have a handle, and I don't like it because I just like having the handle. Um, how do you enter the giveaway? At the end, after I go over all this stuff, Owen and Ollie are going to write a number down. And then the first the person, it's going to be at the end because then people are going to go away. <laughs> okay, and other things that I love for cooks, these Primal Palette Spice Blends, I really, really love a lot. And it's not just because they're my friends. Um, I really do think these are really delicious. Can I write it down um, now? No, no, we're going to wait. So there's a, this, the savory pack I love, literally I will sprinkle these on whatever I'm making, um, like roasted broccoli, stir fries. If I don't have anything in mind for what I'm making, I just use these seasoning blends and I think they're really good. They have a sweet pack for those of you who are bakers. And what I like about these is they're organic, they're super fresh tasting um, and they're non-irradiated and I just think it's great. Oh, that's a uh, let's see what else. Uh, oh, I love these GIR spatulas. Um, I don't, I mean, I have a lot of them, you know, but what I think is really cool are these new flip ones that are, um, I use this little mini one and I think they're sold out on Amazon now, but this is the big one, which I think is a little too big. You can use it on a grill, but I love the mini flip because this is how I make my crispy eggs. I used to, um, I used to use like a little fish spatula, but this is much, much better. Um, and they're silicone, they're super, um, you can throw them in the dishwasher, they're heat resistant, I love them. And I think the design is really great. And there's no wood that gets moldy or anything like that. If I'm, if I'm going too fast, don't worry, everything is on my blog. It's on nomnompaleo.com. It's the latest blog post, 2015 holiday guide. Uh, the name of the spices are the Primal Palette Organic Spices. Again, it's on my site. Just go to nomnompaleo.com. Somebody had asked about the water heater. Oh, yes. Well, the, and the brand. So it's a Cuisinart. It's the Cuisinart Variable Temperature. So, you know, if you aren't into tea or, um, you know, any special coffee you just want, like boiled water, this may not be the one for you because uh, there are cheaper ones that will just boil water. Um, and you can get them like $20, $25. I got mine at Costco, which was perfectly fine and serviceable. But if you want one where, you know, if you're like a tea connoisseur and you want to have like the perfect temperature for green tea or white tea or for pour over coffee, like they have all the settings and it keeps it warm. So it's kind of a cool, it's a cool gift. Um, okay, right now. Oh, and this, this thermo pen. I think it's technically called the Thermopen Mark IV. Um, this is the newer edition of the Thermopen. They just revamped it, I think, this year. And they have a special deal this weekend for Nom Nom Paleo readers. So if you go to my site, there's a link that's only good for this weekend. And I sent an email to you guys as a reminder. But these are normally $99, which I know is expensive. But it's marked down to $85 uh, this weekend, which is still expensive. But it's a really nice gift. Um, Mom, and as Kyle know? says, and he is a maven, it is the best thermometer. It reads things in two to three seconds. It's super accurate. There are things that I didn't like about my old one or bothered me about the old one, but they fixed it. So they have like a sleep mode and um, like if you lay it down, it'll go to sleep. But when you pick it up, it like, it'll wake up again. It has like a low light sensor so that it'll like, the light will turn on. Um, it, the display rotates, which is pretty cool, um, which was also something that I found a little annoying. But all, I think this is this is pretty cool. So this weekend only, there's a deal on these. But only uh, through 
but only through, yeah. I think on their site, they have a deal where you buy two or more, you, it's $85, but the link on my site allows you to do it, to buy just one for 85 and you don't have to bundle it. Um, oh, another thing I love and I gifted myself are these Headley and Bennett uh, aprons. My sister bought me my first one and since then I have just been buying my own and like this one is super cute, like this red one, this Cosmos one. I think it was on sale last week and I bought it for myself. Um, they're not cheap but they make great gifts. Um, so I think that's it for cooking stuff. Now can we do it? Pretty soon. We'll do that at the end because well, I'll, I'll describe that at the end. Oh, so for people who don't sleep well, um, I know sleep deprivation is rampant. I know that for me, I think you need to control, you need to stay well hydrated, you need to have great sleep, and then you can worry about having a perfect diet and exercise. So those, that's kind of the order that I kind of like to do things. And so, oh yeah, see, here's, here's Owen modeling these glasses. So I do have these cheaper amber goggles. They're like $7, which is perfectly fine. This helps block the blue light from, you know, screens that a lot of people are looking at. Um, and the blue light can help suppress uh, melatonin production, which helps you go to sleep at night. Um, so at nighttime, I make them wear these, right, no matter what, even though there's no screen time until Friday at 5 p.m., which I know you guys find annoying. But these cheap ones are like $7, which are pretty good, but it's kind of like not the coolest gift. But Gunner Optics makes some pretty cool glasses and the kids wear them. They're, they're not cheap. They are like around $50, but I think that it, unlike these ones that are $7, they totally scratch and they're goofy looking, right? The kids don't like to wear these, but they are okay with wearing these ones. Um, and I don't read, um, I don't read on my iPhone or on an iPad at night. Um, I use my Kindle, which I like a lot. The Kindle Voyage is pretty cool. Um, I have kid Kindles for the kids um, that don't have like the strong backlight, but I still make them wear these glasses to read them just in case. Um, I don't have any other electronics in my bedroom, but I do have this clock that I love. And I think it's only, I don't know how much this clock is, but it literally is only like $10, $12 and you can totally pack it. Um, it's battery operated, it doesn't make any noise, there's no like ticking, and there's no things that are lit up at night, there's no um, glow in the dark stuff. And if you need to look at the light, or time at the middle of the night, you just press this button and it has a little light. And you can't see it right now because it's bright. So who makes but the glasses again? The fancier ones are Gunner Optics. So this one, Ollie's wearing the Gunner Optics. And again, everything's on my site. You don't have to worry about taking notes. Just go to nomnompaleo.com. My latest blog post is my holiday gift guide. Um, and I think that might be it. Oh, I think I have some food blogging ones if people really are interested. Um, people always ask about the camera. This is Henry's camera. It's very expensive, so it really is only for someone you really, really love a lot or you have wronged in a really bad way. Um, because it's an expensive camera. And then I also link to the um, lenses. As a food blogger, I do a lot of um, computer work, and so I also linked to my stand for my computer. And this is something I recently upgraded to. So, you know, if you use a laptop, it's really hard to have the ergonomics correct. I mean, it's, it's awesome because it's portable, but you do, like, I have a standing um, desk situation at home, and so I have it propped up on this M stand, but then your keyboard is way up here. And so I have um, these new wireless, uh, I think they're called Magic Keyboard and the Magic Trackpad from Apple. And I used to have the old ones, which worked fine. Um, but these new ones I like even better because now, instead of having to replace the batteries all the time, you can charge it every night with your iPhone charger, which I think is pretty remarkable. They're super light. I think there are some complaints on the reviews that they felt really cheap, but I just love that they're super light and I can totally transport them in my backpack. Um, oh, which Henry has over here. This is, I stole this backpack from Henry. Henry got this as a gift when he left his old job, um, but I love it. It's, uh, it's a local company in San Francisco called Mission Workshop and I can fit all sorts of stuff in it um, and I think it's an amazing bag. All right, 
So last but not least, if you are a fan of Nom Nom Paleo, there are some special gifts that you guys can buy for yourself or your friend. Um, so first of all, we have our little doll, which we're going to give away. So um, that's on our website. Um, and I give it away to people all the time. But people always ask about all the cute little like um, accessories that I get because they don't come with a the doll. There are some accessories that come with a doll, but not all the other stuff that I, uh, you know, I take pictures with it. So if you go um, online, Sylvanian Family and Calico Critters make these cool dollhouse stuff and everything is sized the right size for Minnie Michelle. So. You know, if you are looking for accessories for your friend who already has it all, or you have it all, or you want to get it all and get accessories, get the Calico Critters or Sylvanian Family because they are the right size and they are so dang cute. Like, here's a set that I bought because I love mini food, but it comes with like a mini ladle and a mini like chopping board. It's really cute. Like, and it doesn't, they fit in Minnie Michelle's hand, but in order to make it stick, I always put a little bit of Owen's clay to make it like hold it. So that's my secret. Um, and then if you want a signed cookbook, because a lot of people ask for signed cookbooks, it's really hard for me to sign them and send them out. I would love to do that for everybody. Um, and if I have signings, I'm happy to send them, but I haven't had one recently. And so one of my favorite, favorite local bookstores, Books Inc., which I've been going to ever since I was a little kid, um, has agreed to send a signed cookbooks and so I have like last Friday when I signed and personalized a whole bunch of them and up until a December 11th um, they will be sending these out and they should make it to people by Christmas but unfortunately they only ship to Canada and the US um, so if you want a signed cookbook there is a link in my blog post the holiday gift guide um, on how to do that and everybody who orders through Book Sync because I love Book Sync and I love you guys we we'll get a free pair of socks. And these gumball poodle knee highs are the coolest ever. They're super, they're super comfy. They're, they totally stay up. They're perfect for deadlifts, rope climbs, or just if you're just strutting around and you wanna show your love for Nom Nom Paleo, they have my little face on the front. Um, and I actually don't sell these. People are like, how, how, do, how do I buy them? I, I give them away. Um, but I don't, I'm not selling them right now. But if you buy a signed book through Books Inc., you will get one for free. At first I limited it to 50 people, but then I said, hey, let's just give it to whoever um, because I love you guys. So thank you. Thank you for supporting you us. So you can... And I will personalize the books through Books Inc. Um, yes, yeah, so now thank you for being super patient. For all of you who are still here, we are going to do a quick giveaway of all of this stuff. So we have like a Nom Nom Paleo food bag the doll, the socks you cannot buy, and a signed copy of the book. This will go, this whole set, we're going to send it to book. two different people. Wait, can I send All right, to so Owen and Ollie are both going to think of numbers between 1 and 100, and the first person to guess both of theirs well, let's, let's do or one, one of time. Let's do yeah, one, one okay, okay, okay. And then we'll give one yeah. and then we'll do. Yeah. So let's do Owen or Ollie first. Okay, okay. Do one. first. Okay, Ollie will go first. So between one, one and a hundred. So start guessing. So, Henry, are you keeping track? I think I know Ollie's number already. <laughs> okay, and Ollie, hurry. Can they go over? Uh, no, oh wait, wait, wait. You can't show it. These are going so fast. Do you have oh, to be. I don't see it. Here, precise. show me yours. You already told me what. Oh, I did not know. Between one and a hundred. It was 150 first. Oh, this person just got it. Who just did 99? The first 99 I saw was a... Stop, 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 stop. There was a G somebody who had 99. We'll be able to find it on catch. You can go back, Henry. There, was, there were two people with 99, but there was someone who did it first. And then someone did 99 again. <laughs> well, we'll go back. Yeah, we'll go back. Wait, so that's a different number. I think I can contact people. So people keep on saying, me, me, me. Oh my gosh, these are going so yes. quickly. Wait. <laughs> and McCarley? Was that person? I couldn't I couldn't even read. We'll go back. You we'll we can go back, go back on cash. We'll later and we will go back and I will find that person. And yes, don't worry, don't worry. Whoever had 99, we will go back and we will make sure it's all fair. Um, maybe we have to do another giveaway that's 
Okay, Owen. Give her okay. Give her okay. Number. So we'll number? find the first person who did 99, and we will email. It was a blue person, because I remember. But we'll, but I may have missed the first person. We'll watch the night. replay. We'll watch the replay, and I will find that, and I will contact. Should we not um, do numbers? Let's not do numbers. Okay, so for the second giveaway, it's like the same. <laughs> What's your number? Uh, what do you think? What do you guys think? <laughs> a word? Um, I don't know. This is hard. What do you think would be a fair, let's ask people, what do you think is a fair way to give away our second color? Hmm, that's, <laughs> that's hard because there's only 13 colors, crispy chicken, 100 color, color. Letter. letter, okay, well Pick letter, recipe. um, okay, what's my let's, favorite let's, recipe? Let's, oh yes, that's a good one, what's my favorite recipe? No, we can't do that with Molly, okay, um, let's stop unless you're going to give away three. Yay. No, no, stop, stop, stop. Yeah. Okay, numbers are easy. Let's do numbers. Okay, you have to pay attention, and you have to show <laughs> this number. Right, show me the number first before okay. people start All right, guessing. so we, okay. so stop. Nobody don't, guess. Don't guess Nobody yet. guess. Show, that 44 does not count. Okay, so this is for the okay, six. Okay, close it. Okay, close it All up. right, so we're going to start now. A number between 1 and 100. Owen wrote it down. Okay, and who's it go? Go. You don't oh. see it yet. That's pretty good. People are close. Oh, one person got really close. Yeah, nobody caught it so far. I know this is boring. Another I'm close. <laughs> That's really close. People are very close. <laughs> but they, how do you remember? I remember, I remember it. I remember it. You want me to whisper it to you? Uh, no, stop. Stop it. Another close one. Another close oh, one. Nobody, is. nobody has it so far. I know this is super boring for everyone. <laughs> Let's just look at a lot of numbers. Uh. Oh, good. Good job picking a Nobody. Nobody's. Nobody is picking this number. Some people are one off. Can we give them a hint? It's not a prime number. <laughs> oh, people are really close. Oh, wow, uh, that's amazing. Nobody's gotten it. Well, wow, Ollie picked one that everyone was guessing. Um, no, it's not over a thousand. It's between one and a hundred. Oh, people are. Okay, can I give them a, another hint? Yeah. yeah. Oh, one was just so close. Um, it is a. Multiple of, do you know, Owen? Do you know this is a math problem for you? It's multiple of like four? I don't know. Is it? Yeah, it is a multiple of four. What else is it a multiple of? I don't know, eight? It's not. No, no it's not a multiple six, of eight. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> you can see how, how much we push math on our children. Yeah, I know. <laughs> so much! <laughs> okay, it's a multiple of four. What else? What else is it a multiple of? 75! Oh my gosh, this is crazy. Nobody's gotten it. 87, 80, 42. Oh, someone 80, got it! Number got it! Number got it! The first so person someone got it. Someone said 84. Ta-da! So the first person said 84, and the first person the first said 99. Person, person. We will go back, and we will make sure that um, you guys uh, are contacted. All right? And then I think everybody, everybody's on Periscope is on Twitter, so I think I can tweet the person who won. And then we will get your contact info, we'll personalize it however we want, and we'll send it. It may not get put there by Christmas, depending on where you guys live. Because I know to, um, internationally, yeah. Okay, we will go back and we will look, because we can look at all the comments. So anyway, have a great weekend. And if you want to know where any of this was, it was um, like my gift guide information. It's on nomnompaleo.com and it's my 2015 holiday gift guide. Um, the thermo Thermopen is only good for this weekend for the deal for $85. Um, and then the signed books through Book Sync where you will get the free socks is only till December 11th. How do we find out if we want? I'm going to go right now. I'm going to get off Periscope. I'm going to go back and read all the comments to see 
who was the first person to say 99 for Ollie's number and 84 for Owen's number. And then I will contact you guys on Twitter because I think you have to have a Twitter account to be on Periscope. And then we'll post um, the names of the winners yes. on Instagram so you guys will... Yes, we will post the, the winner on Instagram and we'll do it right now, like within the next few minutes. And that is that. Thank you guys.